What is going on, Ben Nation? I hope you're having a great morning. Uh, in fact, I hope that you're looking at the chart and you're super excited by what you see. You're starting to see price action moving without the catalyst that should be coming any moment now, I would think. There seems to be something in the undercurrent that's about to happen. I'm going to be giving you kind of a call to action today because I'm going to need your help and Ben's going to need your help with something. Ben Armstrong, I mean, not uh, ben Coin. Ben Coin by proxy is going to need your help with that. But the important thing is, uh, guys, it is starting to reverse. I've been telling you for so long that we were getting ready for this next move. This next move was going to look like, um, you know, it'll start off. All we have to do is establish uh, certain positions, certain areas, certain ranges. And if we can do that, then we're going to be good, right? Well, Let's look at the chart, and before we do this, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe button, bell to be notified. Uh, but, so this is what the chart really looks like, and you see we got that nice little pump from the Ben's fight, uh, then we got that move back down. However, the move back down, remember, this was our baseline right here. Uh, we found our support right around 57, which is the number that I gave you a long time ago, right? It's ironic that it came there. Uh, then we spiked back up into this 65 range which of course caused a rejection. And then we moved right through this and this is where it gets really good, right? Uh, this is where we just kind of blew right through um, that 7135 area, went right up into 75, which was the top over here and turned that into the move instead of this one, which was great because what that do, what, what that's doing is it's establishing a new paradigm. It's establishing a new range. Uh, and when you come back over here, you can look at it and you can see like that really wasn't a range that was kind of in between. So it's perfect. It's a perfect play out. Now uh, we're slowly but surely kind of eking our way back up here. We came over here. We're touching the top over here. Now the next range uh, is up to 85. When we get to 85, that's when we can potentially have a breakout. Now, looking at the the longer time frames over here, I mean, what I told you way back when over here was, you know, we're in a bearish mode and what we're looking for and what we need to see is we need to see a move above the 100 MA. Well, congratulations, baby. It's here. We made a move over the one, uh, the 100 MA. Now, uh, this is not bullish yet. We're not fully bullish, if you will. Uh, we've got a move on the 20 coming up. We've got a move on the 50 coming up. The 100, however, the 100 still calculating a lot of this data right here, uh, going back 100 candles, if you will. And it's looking at it and still seeing that kind of downtrend. So what we need is we need some more positive sort of action. And if we have a little bit more positive action, then guess what? Uh, that means that trend will reverse. People start to look at that and they'll see that as a trend reversal. Money will just start flowing in. Now, the other thing is Ben is not a meme coin. Uh, it started off as a meme coin, but now it's a, a utility token that just really hasn't released the utilities that go with it yet. So that being the case, you're watching some of these other tokens that are pumping. And I wouldn't fault you if you were invested in them or something like that and looking to, to wait for a moment to see which way the wind blows. But let me be very clear with you about what is going on. Ben Armstrong is the biggest influencer in cryptocurrency. If you look at somebody else right now and you say, well, no, 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 this person's bigger or no, 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 this person's bigger. Uh, ben made those people. Ben put those people on the map to give them the opportunity and the platform to do what they needed to do. And when he got into this squabble, if you will, um, by the, the, the lizard thieves, then the potential alleged, then, you know, that created a vacuum which was rapidly filled up by people like Sam, Crypto Lifer, uh, by George, Cryptos Are Us, um, by Wiener Man, um, Ron ran, you know, ran the Wiener guy. Um, you know, that that sort of a vacuum, it was kind of filled up. Um, and I assume that Rand likes getting filled up, but just, you know, one of those things. But th the point is that, you know, this, this area, uh, he made all these guys. So, uh, Altcoin Daily, they made themselves. Uh, but uh, there's a synergy, and they were kind of around a little bit before Ben, if you will. So, uh, But th the point to this all is that uh, when Ben really puts his effort into something, he wins. He, he went out there, and he beat somebody up for you. Uh, you know, he, he's out here fighting uh, to get the company that was stolen from him, allegedly stolen by alleged thieves from an alleged dirtbag organization, allegedly called Discover Crypto. Um, 
allegedly they've discovered some crypto, but I haven't seen it yet. You know what I mean? So anyway, uh, by the way, where's Gary Gensler? Where's the bearded lizard? And guys, that's where I'm uh, That's where I'm going with this. Uh, uh, I need a call to action. I need you guys today to anywhere on social media to tag um, Hit Networks, uh, to tag Discover Crypto, to tag whomever it is that you know that's part of that organization, anybody, any and everybody. Uh, and I need you to ask them, where is Gary Gensler? Gary Gensler, by the way, if you didn't watch Ben's video last night, is a bearded, uh, one of the bearded dragon lizards. I have the receipt. Uh, well, I don't have the receipt, but um, I, I reached out and I asked, where was it bought? Just out of curiosity. Uh, and found out where it was bought. And they don't have any record of it ever being returned, despite that uh, the old teacher went on Altcoin Daily and said that it was returned. And as we've really seen here, allegedly, TJ is nothing more than a liar. And by the way, there's some testimony that's going to come out at some point. And I'm sure we'll I'm sure we'll have some clarity on the truthiness of old Teejer, uh, Lady Frame, if you will. Uh, so we'll have some clarity on uh, the character of this. You know, um, I, I he was she was married, right? She she was married, right? Yeah, she was married. Anyway, so the point is, uh, don't trust, you know, don't trust them. Uh, but we need to know where Gary is. So if you would, tag everybody associated with uh, with Hit Networks, with Discover Crypto, and just ask the question, where is Gary Gensler? Where is that bearded dragon that, that you guys apparently have misplaced? Uh, also, if you would, at PETA, P-E-T-A, People for the Ethical Treatment of Animals, because we don't know where uh, this pet is. Also, um, and 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 by the way, if you remember, uh, and if you watched the video, um, Ben's son had a channel. Hit Networks has the channel. Discover Crypto has the channel. Who steals from an eleven-year-old child? And then they said, "Well, nobody ever wanted it. I don't even. I don't even think he wanted it." Uh, you don't know. The only time you've been over at Ben's house is to um, um, to 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 go with your little missionary to try to look. Tale as old as time, right? Um, uh, I mean, you, you never know, right? But the point is, if, if you guys could please, today is one of those days where we need a rallying cry. We need you guys to help. It's very important. I know I've gotten a little long-winded here, but this is important. So uh, if you would tag them, where is Gary Gensler? Find out. Today, we want that. We, we want to find out where this pet is, uh, and we want it back. We don't want a replacement. We want to know what they did with this defenseless, basically, animal. Uh, where is Gary Gensler? That's the question of the day. So, guys, help me out. This is not financial advice. My name is Blaze. I'm always right. Thank you so much for tuning in. And remember, Ben is on an upward trajectory, finally. And we should see that manifest itself in short order. Thanks, guys.